Hello viewers, welcome back to SSN24. Tonight, a concerning incident took place during the Chicago Bears' final preseason game against the Kansas City Chiefs at Arrowhead Stadium. In the early third quarter, Chicago Bears safety Douglas Coleman III was involved in a serious injury while attempting to tackle Chiefs wide receiver Cornell Powell. The moment was tense as Coleman fell to the ground, lying motionless. Players from both teams took a knee as medical personnel rushed to the field to attend to him. The stadium fell silent as fans anxiously watched the scene unfold. After being assessed on the field, Coleman was carefully placed on a stretcher and then onto a medical cart. In a touching moment, Bears players and coaches gathered around to show their support for Coleman as he was carted off. The fans at Arrowhead Stadium responded with a heartfelt ovation, hoping for his swift recovery. Despite the emotional moment, the Bears managed to finish their preseason on a high note, securing a 34-21 victory over the Chiefs, capping off an undefeated preseason with a 4-0 record. After the game, Bears head coach Matt Eberfluss provided an update, stating that Coleman had movement in his limbs and had been taken to the hospital for further evaluation. Eberfluss mentioned, when I was on the field, standing over there on the Chiefs' sideline, he was moving his limbs. He gave us a thumbs up, so that was really uplifting to our football team, but I don't have anything more than that. He is at the hospital right now getting evaluated. Douglas Coleman III, who went undrafted in the 2020 NFL draft out of Texas Tech University, has had a challenging journey. He played in the Canadian Football League for the past two seasons before signing a futures contract with the Chicago Bears this offseason. Our thoughts are with Douglas Coleman III and his family during this time, and we wish him a speedy recovery. Thank you for tuning in to SSN24. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe for more updates on this and other sports stories. Stay safe, and we'll see you in the next one.